Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. I am the Great Bearded Summoner, and welcome back to Fire Emblem Heroes, where today we're going to be doing, I'm going to be doing my predictions for the Summer 2 banner, and with these, as with all of my prediction videos, my biases will be showing, and unlike with previous prediction videos, however, this time I will not be predicting any who is actually going to be the duo hero as the options are so varied between the two choices i've selected it doesn't look like it will be it would be even more difficult for me to predict who the duo will be that aside now that made everything clear my first thought for the second summer banner is engage specifically male leer and female leer in some form or fashion because they love dropping the banners they love dropping the playable characters on us one at a time more times than a few usually both at once there's only been rare exceptions to that if I had to take an educated guess at who the duo might be, they might just make these two the duo. Like they've done with a lot of same named units recently. So who else? My honest picks, Hortensium. Namely because Ivy's already there. So her showing up, wouldn't be out of logic in my mind. Diamond. Namely because he certainly fits the beefcake description. He is an exceedingly he is one of the most more popular male characters. And I can hear some of you saying, but what about Alchris? Alchris just had a bridal alt. So I don't while I don't look to see him, I also wouldn't put him being there off the table, but unlikely. And because Diamant's there, and because she doesn't have any other representation other than her base form, Citrine. Why not Lapis? Again, Lapis has already been, Lapis's base form has already shown up, and it, Lapis also, again, has the Bride Alt from last time, from the last Bride Banner. So, Citrine seems like a good fit here. And then finally, I'm showing Winter, but Yanaka definitely wouldn't be unfavored on this banner. And it would also maybe help get, maybe if she could get on a summer all, maybe it would take the bad taste that this one's presence left in our mouths from last year's winter banners from last year's winter gifts so maybe she can get a little more respect I guess would be the word I'm looking for now honorable mentions I could definitely see them finally pulling the trigger on Gold Mary that would not surprise me I could also see Fogato showing up, maybe as a Tempest Trial, make Diamant a banner unit. Again, I could see Alcris or Lapis if they didn't just have Bride Alts, so I'm, they're unlikely, they're not off the table, but they're teetering on the edge, for lack of a better word. Also, would I love to see Oblivion practically explode if Lumera got another alt in a swimsuit that looks almost exactly like her base outfit? I'd be a liar if I said I wouldn't find that funny. <laughs> but I'm not predicting that. I'm thinking they're going to be pulling back on Lumera for quite some time. I've, but Oblivion, I've been wrong before. However, usually I do these reviews, I do these predictions in twos, so what's my thought for the other game? My thought for the other game is three houses. 
specifically male Byleth because he doesn't have a summer alt yet. He has a harvest alt, a Halloween alt, but he does not have a winter alt. He does not have a summer alt yet. So, he is a valid candidate. Hilariously, when I went looking through three houses characters that don't already have summer alts, that list was smaller than you might think. Next prediction, however. Petra. I I am not alone when I say that I feel it's a crime that Petra hasn't gotten an alt. And this is the only representation in Faye she has. That's a crime. And also, she's one of the few... She's one of the few female characters in Three Houses that doesn't have any other kind of representation. Summer or, old, summer or otherwise. But Summer seems to be one of them where they like showing up. So, yeah. The, it, I think Petra really needs... To, if this is a Three Houses banner, Petra needs to be on it. Next up. Flame. She hasn't been there before. She'd make a good Tempest Trial. It's not like we haven't had a Tempest Trial Flyer Healer before, so... And... Barring they do it tastefully, which they did with her... I feel they did with her Halloween all. It would be cute. Kranya. Or her counterpart... Monica. Going back just a second, it's Kranya, you put that in, you put that in a swimsuit, you tell me it won't sell, I'm gonna call you a liar. But evil or not, no. That gets a swimsuit, she will sell. Or at least she'll be Tempest Trial she she'll at least be perfect Tempest Trial material. As far as Monica, Edelgard's already here. She's not far behind, let's be honest. And that also brings in three helps. And then, as mentioned in my previous predictions video, this guy needs a this guy needs a summer all. Dimitri, most of the blue lions also also already have summer alts. So I wouldn't be surprised seeing this guy. Now, one thing I did notice. So some honorable mentions from Three Houses and Three Hopes. Judith, the supporter, one of Claude's supporters from his storylines in both Three Houses and Three Hopes. I could see her showing up. We have Holst. Why not Judith? Also, Lysithia actually does not have a summer alt, does not have a summer alt yet. She has multiple other alts. It's not like she's not represented at all, which is why I didn't physically represent her in the list. But certainly wouldn't be off the table for a summer alt, especially as she doesn't have any three hopes representation yet. Not that there's a lot of those anyway. There's only like five characters that are representative of their three hopes designs. But a summer three hopes Lysithia wouldn't hurt my feelings. As would not a summer three hopes to do. That's one. I think that's one of his best designs. Humble opinion. Other honorable mentions. <laughs> as silly as it's gonna sound, summer Aloise. There's a big old beach umbrella in one, kind of like Edelgard's weapon, but just big old beach umbrella, the bad sunscreen on the nose, tacky sunglasses. I think that'd be a killer look. Bad, button-up, bright, loud, obnoxious, floral print shirt. Yeah, I think I'd be cracking bad jokes all the way. I think Aloise would also be a good honorable mention. But these are my predictions for the second coming summer banner, which we should be getting as of this Friday. We will be getting trailers and thus my reaction to them the coming Friday. And I'll see if I got any of these right. 
do you think I do you think any of these have any grounds in logic or do you think I'm completely off base and we don't need any more three hopes or th three three houses or engaged characters I have a suspicion though one of these is right whether or not I got the characters right another matter entirely also I did forget to mention one of the ideas I got from someone else who I was on a stream with I apologize I forgot who you were again but not my idea an Ashen Wolves Summer. This would not hurt my feelings. Though I think it's unlikely, at least as far as Yuri is concerned, because I follow the voice actor Alejandro Saab on his social media, on his platforms, and on his streaming service where he streams as the VTuber Sayu. And he's been kind of busy. Especially, and he's been kind of busy since about six to eight months ago, which would be about the time where they would need him to voice lines for a summer Yuri. So, as much as an Ashen Wolf summer would be nice, I don't see it for that reason. I could be completely off base, and it could be a summer Ashen Wolves. Summer happy, summer constants would not hurt my feelings at all. But that's about it for me. Again, feel free to let me know whether what how you feel about these predictions, whether or not you're even interested in the Summer 2 banner, or just if you want to if you want to chat in the comment section or on my Twitter or Blue Sky, both will be in the description. Let me know. But until next week and next time, where I will be either free summoning, I will likely be free summoning regardless. I will see you on the battlefield. Take care, everyone.